grown man business. All right, we got another episode of Red Ghost Sports Talk. I'm your host, Red Ghost. Uh, it's NFL today, baby. It's Sunday. Yeah, it's Sunday. Uh, a lot of good games going on. A lot of good games coming up. Uh, right now, we have um, Atlanta Falcons against Tampa Bay Buccaneers on Fox. And we also have Cincinnati Bengals against New York Jets. Uh, Magic Man stepped out, so I missed him. Uh, I missed him to get on this video right here. I'll probably get him on the video later on tonight. But uh, yeah, let's, let's talk about these games. So Tampa Bay against Atlanta Falcons. I'm gonna go with Tampa Bay, man. Uh, I like Jameis Winston, and that defense is looking alive. And uh, they 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 going off of the the Lovey Smith analogy with the defense. So they're gonna. They're going to keep going with that and growing and getting better. So I'm going to go with Tampa Bay over the Falcons, 24 to 17. Uh, Cincinnati Bengals and New York Jets. Yeah, I'm riding with the Jets, baby, all the way. I'm going to give the Jets uh, 24, 24 to 21. It's going to be a close one. Uh, who else we got? We got the Vikings against the Titans, man. Oh, my God. Adrian Peterson against Derrick Henry and DeMarco Murray. I don't know who to go for, baby. That's a tough one, man. That is a tough one. But you know what? I like the Vikings defense, so I'm going to ride with uh, the Vikings, man. I'm going to say this, this game right here is going to be 28 to 21. It's going to be tight. It's going to be tough. It's going to be physical. The Bears against the Texans. Jay Cutler need to leave. He needs to get traded or released. Uh... <laughs> The Texans will win it. Brock Osweiler will have a great day. Uh, I will say, um, I'm going to say 24 to 10. 24 to 10 on that one. Uh, the Browns against the Eagles. A great test. A great test for RG3, starting quarterback. He knows the Eagles. He, play, he played with uh, the Washington Redskins. They are rivals. So this will be a great test for RG3. I don't know who to go for on this one. You know what? I'm going to take a chance. I'm going to ride with uh, RG3 on this one. Uh, I'm going to say... I'm going to say 28 to 27. The Bills against the Ravens. Oh, that's going to be a good one. Reggie Bush is a, a Buffalo Bills, man. I like the Ravens as well. Oh, man. I don't know who to go for on this one. Um, the quarterback is healthy. He's back. But I'm, uh, I'm going to take a chance with the Bills on this one. i say 35 to uh 31 bills charges against chiefs chiefs um chiefs have a, a stellar defense i love their defense they getting better they are looking dangerous as well as the raiders and they are my rivals in competition so i got to keep a close eye on them so i'm gonna say this, this game right here would be 35 to 24 uh chiefs raiders against the saints it's a good test for the. It's a good test for both of the guys, man. The Raiders and the Saints, but uh, I'm gonna take a chance with the Saints. Uh, I like the Raiders too, but I'm gonna take a chance with the Saints. Uh, Drew Brees. Uh, I know the defense. The Raiders' defense is gonna be tough. I think Drew Brees is gonna wear him out, and he's gonna light it up in the fourth quarter. I'm gonna say uh, 28 to 28 to 14, Saints. Uh, Packers against the Jaguars. The Jaguars are young and getting better, but I will go with the Packers on this one. Uh, this was going to be like maybe a 35 to 21 type of score with the Packers winning. And we got the Dolphins against the Seahawks. Oh, wow. Well, the Seahawks, we already know. Seahawks is, is stellar on that defense. They are solid. They playing angry this year. Um, they are gonna beat the Dolphins 21 to 10. Uh, Giants against the Cowboys. I like this one, man. Dak Prescott, Ezekiel, Ezekiel Elliott, Big Zeke playing against Eli Manning, Odell Beckham Jr. Oh man, this is a rivalry. I don't know who to go for, man. I'm a, with with experience. I'm gonna go with the. Uh, the Giants. I'm going to ride with the Giants, man. This right here is going to be close, though. This is going to be like by a touchdown. You know, uh, uh, 
27 to 20. You know what I mean? Uh, the Lions against the Colts. I'm going to ride with the Colts. Um, Andrew Luck with that big contract. Hopefully, he's all the way healthy. Hopefully, he don't get hurt this year, uh, especially with those internal injuries. Uh, I'm going to go with the Colts on this one. This one's going to be close as well. This is going to be like 27 to 21. Uh, tonight, 8 o'clock, 8.30, New England Patriots against Arizona Cardinals. <laughs> I'm riding with the Cardinals, baby. Even if, oh yeah, sorry, uh, uh, Island Beauty, sorry. I got to go with uh, Arizona Cardinals. They're looking solid. They're looking good this year. Even if Tom Brady didn't have the suspension, I would still go with Arizona Cardinals on this one. This game right here is going to be like a 35 to 27 type game. And uh, that's that's about it so far, man. Um, we got Monday Night Football, Pittsburgh Steelers against the Redskins, Washington Redskins. We got the L.A. Rams against San Francisco 49ers. Uh, I don't know who to pick on that one. I think I'm going to wait on that one because um, I might change my mind. But, yeah, I'm going to wait on that one. I might do a report about that one later. But tell me what y'all think, baby. It's Sunday. It's football. It's regular season. 2016 football season, baby. NFL. And this is real gold. This is real grown man business right here. This is grown man season. Uh, I know y'all heard me mess up the other night, the other day. And the phone was ringing in my pocket. But uh, I said grown man season. It is grown man season. I like that. I like that. I might say that for a little while, man. Because it's, it's the opening season. Uh, you know... Thursday night football, Denver Broncos beat the Carolina Panthers 21-20. And this right here is game one for everybody else, man. It's, these teams about to make a statement, baby. So let's talk about it. Grown man business.